The House Education and Workforce Committee takes on Harvard, claiming the elite university absolutely failed to comply with its subpoena for information related to campus anti-Semitism. Molly Line is live outside Harvard there in Cambridge, Massachusetts. Molly, how did Harvard not comply with this order? Yeah, this is essentially about the review that's being done by the committee, the review of the latest documents turned in by this Ivy League institution turned in uh, following these unprecedented subpoenas from the House uh, Education and the Workforce Committee. The chairwoman, the representative, Republican Representative Virginia Fox, released a scathing statement calling Harvard's actions to date shameful, telling us this. We're very disappointed in how Harvard has react reacted to our legitimate request and the role that our committee plays in oversight. These students at Harvard are feeling very unsafe because of all the acts of anti-Semitism there. Fox is promising further action from the committee. Uh, answers potentially held requesting documents that she uh, continues complaining in a statement that many of the 2,500 pages submitted to the committee were duplicates of documents already submitted. Heavy redactions throughout the production made several documents useless. A Harvard spokesperson referred us to a prior statement noting that the university will continue to take actions to combat anti-Semitism in any form, but also sought to defend Harvard's submissions thus far, insisting that Harvard did not double count previously submitted documents, claiming that fourth 1,900 pages have been submitted since January. Meanwhile, the committee is seeking further information from a number of elite institutions, among them MIT and Columbia. Sandra?